Email security. Is your company protected from business email compromise? Business email compromise, known as BEC, is a type of phishing scam where the attacker claims to be a trusted person to use persuasion and a sense of urgency to convince your employees to send them money, give them sensitive information, or download something dangerous. And don't think this only happens to big companies. According to the FBI, BEC attacks have caused companies, big and small, to lose over $26 billion in the last three years. BECs are socially engineered. They prey on emotion to get targets to reply quickly or to cloud their senses. And because BECs don't contain malicious links or attachments, they appear indistinguishable from genuine emails and pass through typical security controls undetected. What does a BEC attack look like? First, the fraudster researches the target, then uses searches like Google and LinkedIn to identify individuals and gets their name, role, and business email address. This can involve studying the target's social media feeds and other online resources. Our attacker has learned that Kevin, a sales director at Acme Inc., is planning a trip to Hawaii for two weeks. Next, the attacker sets up a fake personal email account for Kevin and sends an email to the Acme Inc. payroll team, claiming that Kevin wants to update his direct deposit account details. The attacker explains that he's on vacation, is using his personal email account, and is providing new bank details. The email looks legitimate and passes through the gateway filters, and the explanation for why it's coming from a personal account increases the sense of authenticity. Also, this type of request is not that uncommon for the payroll teams to receive. Plus, the email is sent two days before the next pay date, nudging the payroll team to get this done fast. The result? The payroll team updates the banking details per the fake email instructions. And employee Kevin doesn't get his paycheck. Not only is the company on the hook to repay Kevin, but they now have a big security problem. This is just one example of a BEC attack. Attackers use these techniques to get your employees to download ransomware, share login credentials, authorize fund transfers, or take other harmful actions. So how can you stop BEC attacks from happening to your company? Email security tools should make it a lot easier for employers to stop before they respond. They should look closely at the message and learn what makes it suspicious so they don't become victims to potential BEC attacks.